Oh, <laughs> hey, Richard Blackstone again uh, with today's Create One Love Note, and I am so glad you're here. And, uh, you know, I've told you this before, in case you haven't seen it on a leather love note, but, you know, I'm a water nut. I love water. I, I gave up, uh, you know, beer and all that crap a long time ago, and even coffee and stuff. Uh, I just love water because water is really pure, it, and it, it hydrates your system. <coughs> a lot of things we drink, um, you know, dehydrate us. And that's the cause of a lot of illnesses. Uh, most people are dehydrated. You know, the, their doctors uh, confirm that 90% of all illness comes from dehydration. So drink lots of water. And uh, I drink real pure water. And then I put it in glass containers. And I, I found these old Sobe bottles to be a real cool container. So, um, you know, anyway, that's a little suggestion for you. <laughs> and so what I'm going to do now is uh, read the love note, and then we'll talk about it, see how it applies to your daily life. Okay, today's love note says, Here's an easy trick to take any relationship to a higher, more positive level. When you meet another, consciously see them, well, <coughs> consciously see more in them than they are showing you. Now, two things to remember here. First of all, we are all spiritual beings having a human experience, and secondly, we have all been conditioned to put limits on our unlimited nature. When you see more in another than they are showing you, what you are doing is going past that person's conditioning and seeing the truth of their being. The unlimited spiritual nature that you identify and connect with on a very deep level. All of a sudden they appear much more powerful and attractive to you. Here is how you start your practice. Go look in a mirror. <laughs> oh man, I love it! You know, I, I, I've told you this before, but you know, I don't read these love notes before I do them because I want to get the same kind of feel that you do when, it, when you hear them for the first time. And so all these love notes are, are from our archives. They're you know about a year old. And uh, so when I read them in this video format, I, I don't read the note before I do the video so that I'll be just as surprised as you. And, uh, oh, this is a great one. This is a great one. And um, it's so powerful. You know, I love to do this all the time. As it's in um, India or Eastern cultures, they have a word called Namaste. And um, that means I see you. You know, you look into the eyes of another and you see the spirit of that person in the eyes because your eyes are the windows to your soul. And so when you meet people and you look deeply into them and then and then mentally, this is this is the key, you have the attitude that you see them in their highest light. You see the how the spirit part of them. And uh, when that happens, all of a sudden whoever you're looking at um, becomes more powerful, uh, more attractive, because you are looking at not just the physical person with a personality, what you're looking at is the spirit. And your spirit is looking at the spirit of the person you're talking to. And all spirits know that we're all one in higher consciousness. And so, God, this is such a powerful little tool. And it's so misused in our society because we don't look people in the eye. We don't, uh, we don't acknowledge them as, as high spiritual beings. Uh, we just see their physical form and their um, personality. And that's so limiting. It's all limited by form and physicality. Whereas uh, we are a three-part being made up of the physical, that's our body, the non-physical, our mind, you know, which is universal mind, <coughs> and the metaphysical, which is our spirit, which is everything, everywhere, all the time. That's, how, that's who you truly are. You are a three-part being of mind, body, and spirit, and that spirit part of you transverse all the time, the universe, everywhere. You're, you're everywhere all at once, but we're individuated into this physical form to perform this life journey on planet Earth. And, and man, it's a fantastic journey. But as you're on this journey, the key to remember is that you're not just a physical body. You're a spiritual being in a physical body. <laughs> but you're going to return to being a physical being um, after this game is over, you know, when you experience what you call your physical death. But you're not going to die because, you know, life never dies. You're, you are life <laughs> because you're a spiritual being. You're not a physical being. I mean, you, okay, I think I wore that one out a little. <laughs> 
Okay, so that's a love note for today. And what we do at Create One Love here is create products and services to help you understand this stuff at a deep level. Because what happens when you do that really empowers you. It's all about empowerment. Once you empower yourself, then you can understand that you can create your life exactly the way you want. All you have to know is these simple tools. And that's what we teach you. So that's it for today. Uh, let's see. Uh, the free gift today. Did I say free gift? <laughs> is uh, get blueprint for manifesting.com. Go to that website and you can get this free ebook. It's part of the Blueprint for Manifesting system. It's called Three Foundation Pillars. Fantastic book. Uh, audio there too. Uh, really cool audio. Download that audio. You're going to love it. Okay, that's it for today. I'll see you tomorrow on the next one. And until then, as always, <laughs> live in love. Ooh.